This joint was created using the adjustable jig and mortise and tenon system. This is the jig. And this is the tenon. And this is how it attaches. First, let's look at the kit. All right, let me show you what's in the kit. We have an adjustable jig. This adjusts up to three different sizes, four by four, five by five, and six by six. And that's to accommodate the three different size fastener tenon plates that we have available. It comes with a self-centering bit, and this is for attaching the tenon to the table leg, and I'll show you how that works later. You also get a pattern bit. Now this pattern bit is a quarter inch, and depending on what kit you select, you can either get the quarter inch kit or the eighth inch kit. And basically we just swap this out for the eighth inch pattern bit or the quarter inch pattern bit. And that's because you can either use the lightweight uh, tenon fasteners, which are eighth inch thick, or you can order the thicker plates that are quarter inch. So let me take this jig out and show you how we're gonna create our first mortise. You first want to index the jig on the edge of your table. Make sure you set it to the proper tenon size. Next, you're going to use some screws to secure the jig to the tabletop. Then, use your plunge router and place it inside the jig and plunge down and start routing out your mortise in a circular pattern. Once you've routed out your mortise, remove the two screws. Then, remove the jig. Next, we're going to attach the tenon to the table leg. You will need to use the jig to properly index the tenon to the table leg. Make sure you have a clamp available to hold the jig in place. Next, place your tenon against the jig. Then, use the self-centering bit to drill two holes in the micro-adjustment slots. Next, screw in two pan head screws. Make sure to tighten slightly. Remove the clamp and jig. The micro adjustment hole allows the plate or the fastener to move independent of your table leg. This allows you to properly align and index the table leg to the edge of the table, making micro adjustments as needed. Once you've adjusted your leg, lock in your adjustment by tightening the two pan head screws. Next, use the self-centering bit for the holes that are going to be attaching your leg. Then, insert your screws. And then, remove your two pan head screws. If you want extra support, you can always install a very large screw in the center. I installed 3 inch screws in the remaining holes. Now that we've attached the tenon, it's now time to place it in the mortise. To secure the tenon in the mortise, you will first need to use your self-centering bit to drill some pilot holes. Then, you will insert your screws and tighten them down. Now, your table's complete. If you have any questions about the adjustable jig and mortise and tenon system, be sure to leave a comment. Till next time, I'll see you later.